Malou Darby. Welcome to my channel. If it's not your first time watching, welcome back. Today, we are once again talking about Telfars. I did my little Telfie unboxing for the Melissa collab um, about a month ago now, I think. And I got some questions just about differences from the leather one, size differences, comparisons. If I have this one, do I need this one? Do I need this one? Should I get both of them? That kind of thing. So I wanted to do a live like side by side comparison of each bag kind of show you the differences in each so if you already have a leather one if you're trying to decide between the two it'll just kind of help you get an actual comparison because from what i've seen on the site there's no like true direct comparison for all the details so without further ado let's get into a little telfar review comparison okay so i have both my bags here um they did just do literally like when i filmed it they just did a traditional bag drop and um the last melissa stock was i believe about a week ago and they've been doing pretty consistent restocks of the melissa which i was pretty surprised by so today i'm going to be reviewing the um medium in both bags and just for price comparison the medium in the traditional leather bag is 202 at retail and the uh, medium in the other in the Melissa collab is $200 so about the same price so just right from the uh, packaging this is let me scoot over for y'all this is the dust bag that you receive for the leather so standard white Telfar logo black strings again I keep my dust bags I do not play my dust bags with my bags and then you guys already know the Melissa collab comes with this kind of canvas more canvas pattern and it has a little bit more detail on the bag with the Melissa logo as well as the Telfar logo. So taking them out to compare them side by side, I have the green leather. So when you pull the leather out, this is how this one will appear. Definitely very different visually, um, which is why I think they're honestly two different bags. Like they're both the shopping totes, but they're definitely two very different bags, two very different styles. So to hold them up for you guys, this is the medium in the standard leather here we go and this is the medium in the melissa so you can see just by the side by side the difference in size um i've seen a lot where people are putting their bags inside like their leather bag inside of the pvc bag which honestly i feel like is a little tricky because the leather is a little bit bigger than the pvc bag so you guys know the, with the leather one, you do have, you have to push it out. It doesn't have the structure to stand on its own. So you do have to push it out, but there are a few key differences with the bags. So with the leather, um, you don't have, like I said, any structure and there's nothing to make it stand. Obviously with the PVC, they have the legs on the bottom. So not only does it just have the structure to be visible from the side, but also when you sit it, it's not sitting directly on the surface. So that's one thing I really like. Um, I would love to see legs added to the leather, even if it's just like the little metal pegs on the bottom, just so when you sit it down, it's not directly on the surface that you're sitting it on. Um, another very large difference. Well, first you can see that the PVC logo is a lot more embossed into the outside shape of it so the outside front of it there's a lot more embossing of the logo it's a little bit more smooth on the leather but most importantly i think the biggest difference for me is that in your leather telfar you are going to have a snap closure to close it so you will be able to put your stuff in it close it it doesn't close fully so if it falls over like these sides are still open but you can snap it in the middle so it doesn't just sit open whereas with the melissa pvc bag there is no closure at all so this is always it generally kind of leans into itself anyway so it's relatively closed but this is never there's no closure also when this thing falls over it falls over everything is going to fall out of it um depending on how you have it set up because there's no way to close this i actually even considered putting my own little fastener on there or something like that just to make it a little more secure if should i say another big difference probably yeah another very big difference i'm going to say maybe the biggest is that in your leather you are going to have a pretty large pocket inside um with a zipper so you can store yourself put your items it has a little logo on it but it just gives you a little bit more of a purse feel even um in the larger one you'll have your pocket in the mini you don't have a pocket you have like a small kind of card wallet pocket in your mini 
but you still have some kind of at least put your phone and your cards in there which is very useful so you put your really important stuff in the zipper you zip it up button it and this one's secure with your pvc again no snap but you also have no pocket whatsoever there is no pocket in here at all so you almost have to get an organizer for this one or else your lip gloss all that kind of stuff will just be loose and everything will just be in here so for me the way that these function without the fastener and without the um, pocket this one feels a little bit more like a utility bag or I like to use this a lot for my laptop bag versus this one I feel like can be a little more dressed a little more functional I guess but I have don't get me wrong I have not stopped wearing this this has gotten worn every day since I've gotten it still you can't take the straps off on either but I will say with the leather when you take the straps off you are able to kind of more seamlessly put the straps into your bag and they don't really obstruct as much so you can put them in there and it doesn't really affect how much you can store with the PVC honestly if I'm not using the large strap I just let it hang because they are thicker and they're not as flexible so when you put them in they're kind of jumbled so if you do have your laptop and everything in here it's a little bit hard to put the straps in this one so this one for me definitely like I said is giving more work bag vibes beach bag vibes just a quick video you can really see the size difference there just a quick video um so you guys can just see the difference if you are shopping if you are waiting on the next drop you got your calendar set for the next restock just so you can decide which one you think is best for you so let me know if you already have a tell for which one you have are you waiting on the new colors which style of bag you think is a better fit for you and yeah that about covers it thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you in the next one